In today's video, I'll show you how to create this viral Earth zoom transition using Premiere Pro and Higgsfield AI. Let's begin. So in Premiere, I added this video to the timeline. And what we're gonna need is a screenshot of the first frame. Let's move the playhead to the beginning of the video, then head over to the export frame button here. Let's give this file a name and for the format, choose JPEG. Choose your location and click OK. Now go to the Higgsfield website, there will be an affiliate link for that in the description, and once you're there, search for the Earth Zoom Out visual effect. Currently, that effect is right here at the top of the list on their homepage, but you can always use Command or Control plus F to easily find it. Here it is, so let's click on it. You'll see a few examples on this page, and here you have Generate. Then on the left you have the option to import your photo. We're going to browse for that first frame screenshot we saved from Premiere and click Open then simply click Generate. Now we're gonna have to wait for a little bit for the generation. For this video, it took me one minute of waiting. And here we have the generated video. Now all we've gotta do is to reverse this video and speed it up a little at the end. So for that, let's save the video, then open Premiere again, and here import our video using Command or Control plus I. Then drop the video in the timeline, scale it accordingly, then right click and go to Speed slash Duration. Here, simply check the reverse speed box. Now let's move the original video right where the other one ends. Then to speed up the first video, right click on it and at the bottom look for show clip keyframes, then go to time remapping and speed. Then double click on the video track to enlarge it and you'll see this white line across the clip. That line basically controls the speed, and if you hold command or control, you can add points to adjust the speed for certain parts of the video. Then click and drag the line upwards to speed up the video. Premiere will automatically update the length of the clip, and then to refine everything, you have these handles to smooth out the transition. And this is the final result. If this video helped you, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Visit the Creative Society website for more design resources and music. If you want to continue learning, check out this other video on the screen. Thank you, and see you next time. This is Creative Society.